Hello everyone, this is Dan and welcome back to the shop. Today we have something very special for you to see. Voila! Huh, spark plug doesn't seem very special, but when you put this and a car window together, you get a beautiful explosion of glass shards flying all over the place. So, we're gonna show you how to break a window with this, using a spark plug. But before we get started, if you did not yet subscribe, you can do that right now so you don't miss any interesting videos. And before we actually start breaking this glass with this spark plug, we're actually gonna put this through a test. So we're gonna actually throw all kinds of stuff at it. Uh, wood, bricks, hammers. I mean, we're gonna see exactly how much energy it takes, what will break it, what breaks it faster. And then we're gonna compare it to this. Like I said, it doesn't look like much, but believe me, I believe this is probably gonna be the easiest and least amount of energy spent on breaking and shattering glass. Tell me what you think about that later in the comments. Let's go. All right, here we have it, folks. These are the things we're gonna be using to try to break the window. Let me go over them with you really quick. These are the spark plugs. There's many of them in there. We're gonna be using these last, and I'm gonna show you exactly how to do it. Now, here we go. This is a piece of wood, two by three pine. It's very light, but we'll see what we can do with that. Here we have a sludge hammer. I mean, this thing weighs about 14 pounds. Um, I'm definitely sure we'll break the window with it, but depending how hard we hit it, I'm pretty sure we might not even succeed uh, if we hit it uh, light enough. Here we have a regular east swing hammer, okay? Smaller surface area. You'll definitely break the window with it, uh, depending on the speed again. A brick, you can't forget the brick, guys. You always need a brick. You wanna go break a window, break a brick. Take a brick, break a brick, break a window, take a window, break a brick. Take a brick, okay? Here we go, we have a brass hammer. Brass mallet, okay? Solid aluminum, weighs about seven pounds. Okay, let's see, what do we have? We have a rubber mallet. Can we break a window with it? I'm not sure, we're gonna try. Uh, here we go, this is a, um, I mean, it's plastic. It's a plastic mallet with two sides of the plastic, different, uh, different uh, strengths. We'll see what we can do with that. Okay, we have two rocks, size of golf balls, okay? Perfect chucking stones, okay? Four by four, pressure treated piece of wood, okay? It's heavy, but it's lighter. Uh, it's a little heavier than pine, but it's, you know, not super heavy. So we'll see what we can do with that. We got a really big rock, really big rock. Once they waste 10 pounds, I'm really excited to try to see what I can do with it. Pretty sure I'll break a window. Uh, you can have a uh, pine log. This is pine, not oak, so it is lighter, but we'll chuck this thing at the window and see what happens. Here we have a helmet, and I am not going to be wearing it while I do this. I am going to be trying to break the glass with it. See people get mad trying to break into somebody's car to beat them up or something. Well, we're going to see. This, can this break the window, or will this break against the window? But we'll, we'll check it out. Now, before we get started, I just want to let you know we're going to be working in reverse order. So I'm going to be using the things where I think will not break the window first so we don't run out of windows. All right, so let's get started. actually work. I mean, it really depends how you hit it, honestly. I mean, if you hit it just at the right angle with a nice point, uh, you will break. So, let's try, uh, let's try a 4x4 four four block. We're gonna try a brick, guys, okay? That window. Gonna chuck one really good one. We'll see if this whole log will break. What do you know? It actually works. Rock breaks. Let's see if this breaks the rock.
So that's what we can do with a sledgehammer. Well guys, pretty much everything on that car broke the glass except that rubber mallet. I did want to give you guys a visual on how different objects react to the glass and how it shatters and how much energy you can kind of see me using for that to happen. Now I did not give it my all because I wanted to slowly, gradually increase the power of me either throwing the piece of wood or hitting it with a hammer until it broke. Otherwise, if I gave it my all, I'm pretty sure I can break it with every hit. Um, and there was times before when I did this, I mean, I used the sledgehammer and I actually tried, a really big sledgehammer, and I actually tried breaking the glass and uh, a few times it actually wouldn't work. Um, probably on the third or fourth try, it would actually break. So I didn't use a sledgehammer this time because it's a hit or miss. Sometimes you get it on the first try and sometimes you don't. So either way. Now, what we're gonna be doing, and I'm gonna be showing you what we're actually gonna be doing with these spark plugs. Now, I'm gonna be actually breaking them. I'm not gonna be throwing them at the glass. I'm gonna be breaking them and uh, taking these little bits of the ceramic. It's gonna be pretty interesting to see how tiny of a piece of ceramic uh, breaks the glass. Now, it's uh, also kind of a hit or miss when you throw little pieces of ceramic because, you know, when you break it apart, it has maybe three, four, five, six edges, sharp edges, and that's really what uh, breaks the glass. So it's not it's not the ceramic part itself, it's, it's uh, uh, the sharpness. So if you hit it just right, it'll break it. So if it hits it flat, um, it's really not going to do anything. You'd have to really throw it really fast to actually, you know, have some kind of effect on it. But if you hit it just right, so you'll see me throwing them, um, and uh, sometimes it won't break it, and, and, and sometimes it'll just break it from the first try. But you can judge for yourself. I'm going to show you exactly what I'm going to be doing with these spark plugs right now. Alright guys, here we are. This is the ceramic pieces. They're very tiny. They're like the size, half of the size of my uh, fingernail. Uh, some bigger uh, uh, and, and some smaller, but either way, we're gonna start chucking them. Okay. See if we can get it on the first try. Wow, first try. Thank you for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed. If you did, please subscribe. And if you have any comments, leave them down below. And if you have any suggestions on what you want to see next, leave them down below as well. Thank you.